Good morning, Centerville, and welcome to the Coffee at the Continental Show. We're here to get you up and on the go. So come on down and have an espresso, or a simple low cup of joe, and watch a coffee at the Continental Show. Good morning, Centerville. Good morning, good day, good luck. Yeah. Stop opening. It says start and stop. There we go. Yeah, we're on the clock. Good morning, Centerville. We're on the clock. We're on the clock. We're on the clock right now. We've got to hurry. Here we go. Ready, Jeff? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. I think we've wasted enough time already. Yep. Because we're on the clock. We're on the clock. The stopwatch. There you go. <laughs> Gotta have a good day. Good morning, Santa Good morning. You know, I think I know why the show sucked yesterday. I was too, I was warm and comfortable in there. Yeah. I was too warm and comfortable. I was boring. I was, you know, just sitting in my comfy chair with my warm coffee and I didn't care. Yeah, so we have we have to be what we want the show to be. We have to be cool and on edge. <laughs> I, now we're cold. We're outside. Exactly. Oh, cool and on edge. See? Wow. I missed that. Yeah. And you said it, but I missed it. Man. Okay, Little Wayne. Little. Are oh. we going to talk about Little Wayne? I, if I have my dreads and a and a <laughs> and a teardrop tattoo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, and a beanie. God, we could do something with this. Uh, the rapper will spend the remainder of his prison sentence in uh, solitary confinement, so he's in administrative segregation. But isn't it he's true? Done. But it, but isn't it true that even though he's in there, he he still expects to get off oh, early? Oh yeah! Oh yeah! He's still getting out for good behavior eight months of a year, and yet, <laughs> but he's okay. in Rikers. Yeah, but it's um, gotta be a tough crowd. Uh, oh yeah. But if if you uh, imagine us in Rikers. I don't want to You imagine definitely need those uh, sex safety tips I gave you <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, anyway, little Wayne, uh, yeah, little Wayne, he uh, snuck headphones and a charger <coughs> for an MP3 player uh, into his cell that weren't actually bought from the commissary. Ooh. That's so. You, that's yeah. I don't think that constitutes good behavior. Well, I don't think it <laughs> constitutes administrative segregation either, but come on. I mean, there's a lot worse things going on in there. Very true. Surely. Surely. Uh, yeah, he is still on a track to be out uh, after eight months of his year bid for good behavior. So, Yeah, man. Now stop carrying around semi-automatic weapons in your tour bus. <laughs> Jeez. Hey, did you hear about the Twitter quitter? Twitter quitter. It's Twitter quitter. Who John quit Mayer. John Mayer quit Twitter. Good. <laughs> Were you one of his followers? One of his 137 billion? I don't know. 337 billion? I don't know. No, I, I, I wasn't one of his followers. That's why I'm uh, saying it's good that he quit Twitter. Okay, he posted on his blog, and this is, this is uh, directly what he said. It occurred to me that since the invocation of Twitter, nobody who has participated in it has created any lasting art. And yes, yours truly is included in that roundup as well. I, I create art before I twit. Tweet. Twit? <laughs> before I'm a twit. Uh, you know, like, we shoot the show, and we don't tweet it until later. Yeah. Well, this, is, this isn't art. Come on! Yeah, come on, man. This is crazy art. This, who the heck would do crazy this? art, man. Who? 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 Who, who, who I ask you? Nobody who? would even care. Nobody. At all. You know, and, and and that's why I posted those links, Jeff. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a little, okay? Today, this is your uh, research day. No, not research day. This is this is we are we are uh, we're going to um, punish you. You're being punished. That's right. Being punished. Um, maybe we'll reprimand. You know, I think I'll just give you some advice. Yeah. How about that? That's good. Let's just give, let's just go with advice. <laughs> yeah, that works for me. I don't know if you're shaking from the cold or you think you're gonna get beat up. Both. <laughs> <laughs> I don't beat up my nephew, Centerville. Uh, okay, so here's the deal. All right, and I've noticed this throughout life myself. You can put things off and do things half-assed and get by. But the only people that actually experience success, they make it. They go out every day and they do it. And they do the best they can. That's the only reason why people experience success in life is themselves. Now, people around them, sure, family, friends, all that helps. 
But if you don't make things happen for yourself, nobody's going to come along and hand them to you, buddy, on a plate. With the gold spoon and the silver platter. Not going to happen, but look at me. <laughs> I come out here every day trying to make something happen. Exactly. You have to. You have to do it. So you got to do the best at everything you do. So that's why I gave you all those awesome safety tip links yesterday on Google. And, uh, so there you go. And I think you're going to do a fantastic job with it. Do you have one today or did you not even look at the links? Uh, I, just haven't, I, 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 I hadn't had a uh, chance to peruse them. Yet. No, because you're putting it off and being half-assed. That's why. See? You can do it, bud. Look at that awesome commercial we just shot for the Continental. Let's roll that. The Continental, ladies and gentlemen. Jeff does their first commercial. Here we go. And our coffees today are in these awesome little to-go cups that keep our coffee warm. So if you want to come on down to the Continental and get yourself a coffee, it goes in this awesome little to-go cup with this, it's got texture on the outside and it feels good in your hand and it keeps your coffee warm. Oh yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jeff Comstock. Oh. Woo! Uh, I think we'll use that in some of their ads before uh, before other videos for their ad. Awesome. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wasn't following John Mayer either, but I don't know. Whatever. I guess his last twit was, "What does this button do?" Sweet twit. He's a he's, he's a, a twit. He's a twit for quitting Twitter. Twitter quitter. Uh, hey, I, I saw a poll on the Daily Iowegian, uh, if I, and it asks, "Will you go to the Avenues County Haunted History Tour this Sunday?" Is that this Sunday? Well, I don't know because I looked all over the website for some information on this thing. I can find anything. Well, there's I, I know there's posters uh, posted around the square here in the windows. Are there? Yeah. Okay. So maybe that's what they're talking about. I would have liked to see then the, the poster or an ad below that saying yeah. what exactly it was. Yeah. Because, I mean, I'm not going to take a poll if I don't. If you don't know what's going on. I was really excited. I'm like, yes, I'm going. I clicked yes, actually. You know, I was like, oh, yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I may have looked around first, but good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, and I didn't find it, but I was like, yeah, I'm going to go, and then I, I figured I'd find it, but I still didn't find it. Um, and, you know, not your fault, DLAI, we just, we're just giving you a plug here. Yeah. Right? It's a good plug. It's a good plug. Because you had the poll, so I'm excited for the poll. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to go. Now, I think only 13 people have taken the poll, but so far, but maybe some more people will take it. I don't know that people go to their website to take polls, but I, I don't know their poll statistics either. Either. I have no idea. Uh, Big Red Football this week, Friday. We've got uh, uh, we're uh, Fairfield, yeah, away versus Fairfield Friday. Yep. JV and Vars no, varsity and freshman. Yep. God, I suck. Go to the pitch sports throw down. Yeah, go to the, I can't even talk. The speech. Get the speech, 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 Go check out the pitch sports show dot com, ladies and gentlemen. I think I got it out that time. Yeah. And they'll let you know what when the games are happening. <laughs> don't okay, don't listen to us. Don't listen to us. We say this every day. Um, however, we continue to tell you what's going on. Uh, Monday, JV at home versus Fairfield. So, And that, that we're going to hopefully get some footage of. I didn't make the volleyball game last night. <laughs> I keep saying I'm going. Today, I am going to be at the invite, the cross-country invite. I will be out at the Manhattan at 430, so I'm, I'm pretty excited about that. Check that out. Uh, uh, Red at Volleyball, Varsity won 3 to nothing. even though I wasn't there, and that's probably why they won. Probably, I should probably stay away from that game. Probably. Uh, they're doing good. So, awesome. And uh, on the 5th, uh, they'll all be away at Moravia, and then the 7th, they're back home versus Clark. So, uh, I need to get this. I, I need to get on. Hey, it's Thursday or Friday. Uh, hey, what's today? Today is Tuesday. The what? The 5th. Right, so it's Thursday, the 7th. It yes. would be... Home versus Clark. And that's right at volleyball. Because I know we're all over the place. And again, the pitch sports show .com, They have all this information. Yes, they have all this information. So 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 if you're watching this, you're kinda like, <laughs> I don't know if these guys are right. Then just go to the pitch sports show .com. <laughs> Woo, it's cold out here. Oh yeah. I've got the van run. We are ready to book it back Get some heat. Uh Avenues County Weekly Meals, uh it was last night. It's yep. Monday night. So don't forget, if you didn't get out there last night, then get out there next Monday. Yep. We gotta get out there. Oh yeah. I mean, what if Vicky must just think we just ditched her completely. When's the last time we've been talking before Vicky? We gotta get out there. The, the funny thing is, ditched her kind of sounds like ditched her. 
<laughs> we did stir dish for Vicky Dister. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, we're funny. We don't even know it today. <laughs> well, I know it. Oh, you yeah. <laughs> I don't know it. Jeffrey knows. At least you're good for something, Jeff. I'm, I'm serious. I, that's why I keep morale, ladies and gentlemen. When I'm not funny, well, we can surely depend on Jeff to find some humor in me being stupid. <laughs> I'm funny and I don't even know it. Jeff's got to tell me. Hey, yeah, that was funny. Um, and yeah, these cups are awesome. I think you did a great job with the commercial one. What, uh, what's next? Are you going for like the big time? Are you going to do like uh, oil of Olay or something? Um, I think I'm going to try to get on the, uh, the Kicks box. The Kicks box? The going to be on the, the Kicks box. The Kicks cereal box. Yep. Okay. Well, let's see if we can do that. Make it happen. <laughs> oh, yeah. um, and you know, if you uh, brought some Kicks out every day, and ate them on the show, I'm sure we get their attention. <laughs> I bet they got kicks in there, dude. I'm surely they do. They've got the big cereal dispenser with 20 kinds of cereal. They got it all. Maybe not 20. Five or something. Yeah. Which you should probably come down here and check out. <laughs> it's really cold, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to keep moving on the show here. Business in the spotlight. Spotlight. Highway to auto sales. <laughs> Woo! That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Two miles east of Centerville, of Centerville. 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 It's two miles away from Centerville. Go with me. <laughs> two miles east of Centerville, Iowa, on Highway Two. Uh, and yeah, go get yourself a car or a truck or whatever. He's got some classics out there. I think he's selling his uh, coupe too. I think he is. But you'd have to go talk to him about that. Uh, I've seen it at the shows, you know, I've seen it for sale. It's the car we use on the ads. Yeah, that turquoise. Yeah. Pretty nice wheels. Very nice. Definitely. 641-437-7349. So if you want to give a call before you head out, uh, out of town over there. And he's got some cars over here on five parks. Uh, and I, I don't like, there's two dealers that park cars out there. I'm not going to tell you which ones because I don't know exactly. I think it's the one, the ones that are in front of Clark's are his. Pretty sure. And Quality Auto. And if he's wrong, well, then that's no, uh, there, there's really no difference. Then they're the other ones that are yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Member in the spotlight is Michelle. Michelle used the free classifieds. We had another free classified posting yesterday. Uh, someone's looking for a refrigerator. So if you get on the website, click the classified tab. Somebody's looking for a working refrigerator. They're willing to give 100 bucks for it. They don't care. They just want to keep their food cold. Um, they're probably in between right now. Uh, and their refrigerator probably broke. I mean, yeah, so I'm guessing. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, maybe they need an extra one. They're just looking for an extra one. I don't know. So, so yeah. So so if you're looking to get rid of a refrigerator and you it works and and and, and it works and uh, you need a hundred bucks. Yeah. Like that then, or something. Then, then go to insideofalawa.com and go to the classifieds. Yeah. And call that person. Uh, and I'm not going to mention names because I can't even remember who posted it. Somebody posted. It. We'll have a name uh, for you tomorrow if the classified isn't already responded to. Yeah. Oh wow. Look at you, Jeff. You're Professional today. Oh, so, so excited. We've got big, big thanks going out this morning to all the area businesses that make it possible for us to be idiots Monday through Friday. And those businesses are Bradley Hall, Brad Shell, Centerville Body Shop, Clark's Auto Repair, The Columns, Computer Zone, The Continental, Curves, Dose Web Design, X Line Country Store, Factory Direct Carpet, Go Centerville, The Gold Boutique, Hawk Insurance Agency, Highway 2 Auto Sales. J&K Market, J&K, the show at J&K tomorrow. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, tune in. Junction in Napa Centerville, PV Choppers. Got to get out and talk to Jim. Oh, yeah. Got to get out there. Yeah. Pettit Plumbing and Heating, go Johnny! Quality Auto Center, Ritter Enterprises, which is you sold what and all that crazy cool stuff. Square Deal Maytag and this, that, and everything are, are good, good friends that, that still provide the loaner camera that we still got. <laughs> We still have not returned. <laughs> we still have not fixed our camera. Yes. But that's all right, because we're just waiting for Jeff to break this one, too, so we can absolutely have nothing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's been an awesome, awesome, awesome show. We love you, Centerville. Jeffrey, any final words? Um, come out of the coffee continental and get yourself some coffee, and maybe even some kicks. <laughs> we love you, Centerville. Have a great day. Tell Centerville you love them.